hello welcome welcome back to budget with mads um i was going to test out a new setup today and not use the blanket as the background and just use the wood floor um because i thought that this would be cute this is a little candle with an m on it but you can't even see it um and it's currently resting on these little coasters that i've been um crocheting which i might put um on my shop for cheap i've got a lot of colors um, so I just kind of wanted to showcase that. It's actually a baby pink, but the camera's not picking up a very nice colour. I don't know, maybe we'll do this video like this, but should I light that candle? I'm a bit afraid. Or oh, I don't know if I like it. Right, I'm going to quickly switch up and put um, an actual background here um, and just scrap that. But let me know what you think. I think this candle's really cute, but um, yeah, it doesn't really matter if you can't see it. Give me two seconds. Just thought I'd try and switch it up, but I don't like it. <laughs> so, everything's in the way. There's fluff everywhere. Oh, it's a bit dirty, but just you didn't see it, all right? That just feels a lot more normal. There we go. Sorry if you just saw my hair. Okay, take two. <laughs> right, now take two. <laughs> Hello, welcome or welcome back to A Budget With Mads. Anyway, um, so this video is going to be my second cash stuff in for my second paycheck. This will be running from the 18th of, no, that's a lie, from the 1st of August to the 14th of August. However, um, I do get paid on the 8th of August and I think I've decided that I'm going to split my main income into two cash stuffings. So in a way, this is going to last from the 1st of August to the 14th because I get paid again for my second income on the 15th but I will also be restuffing on the 8th so I don't know if any of that is going to make sense so mm, yeah I don't really know how else to explain it um hopefully that makes some sort of sense so hopefully I'm going to be stuffing weekly with my second income it'll be just over um bi-weekly with the two stuffings each paycheck so my main income and my second income are both going to get split into two so that there's four stuffings a month for each this is going to be two weeks per thing i don't know anyway i'm going to stop talking because i can't explain it i've never been really good with my words hopefully that makes any kind of sense regardless today we are stuffing 220 pounds which is really really good for my second income um because I picked up a few, uh, I think I picked up an extra shift or an extra shift in a few hours last pay period. I should be hopefully doing the same um, this pay period because I'm working 13 extra hours this weekend. So should be okay next month as well, but we should have £220 here. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, 5, 10, 15, 20... Oh yeah, and I took five, oh yeah, no, 225. This five actually hasn't been allocated a place because I thought it was 220. Um, <laughs> so that five we're just going to chuck in somewhere random, somewhere in the middle. Uh, so how has everyone's week been? I'm still trying to post and get everything up to date, um, especially because I'm now going to have an extra video in the month as well. Um... I've been doing some googling because my Etsy payment reserve has finally come to an end um, and I was thinking about stuffing some of my YouTube and my Etsy money um, but I was putting aside some of it for tax and I might still do that um, but I think having done some research you only need to pay tax if you're making more than a thousand pounds in the tax year and I'm definitely not um, so I think I'm okay to just go ahead and stuff it, but I am a little bit scared, so I don't know. I'm still thinking about it, but hopefully some bonus videos will be coming soon. Mm, I just want a quick appreciation for the nails, of course. It's going to be blurry, but it's fine. I absolutely love them. Sorry, I, I got them today, um, and I love them. Anyway, 
shut up this is not what the people came for <laughs> so first of all starting off with spending I have no notes left and also this envelope is broken um so what i have just been doing is peeling it open but now i don't know if i can do that with these nails oh no and um, I know you can just reattach the thing. I have still got the thing, but it hasn't actually worked. So I think I'm just going to have to buy a new one and make do for now, which is really sad. Um, so yeah, we've got... That's a really shiny £2. We've got um, £2, £3, £4, £5 pounds left over. Just going to pop that up there. You can't even see it. Um, and this 50p is just going to go back in spending. And for the next two weeks, this is going to get £40. So I really need to figure out a way to explain it because I'm going to be saying, oh, for the next two weeks because my second income will get restuffed in two weeks. However, spending is now going to get stuffed weekly out of my, um, like, including out of my main income as well. Um, if you just heard that, that was my air freshener. <laughs> Um, so I don't really know how to explain it, but in my mind, because the second income is being stuffed again in two weeks, it's for the next two weeks, but yeah, I'm going to stop talking. Um, Beauty is actually open. Only has 15 left now, which I'm gutted about um, because I went and bought some nails Ooh, and a couple of other bits. I can't even remember what I bought, um, but Beauty is actually getting another £10. So it now has £25, and I need to stop touching this if I ever want to save up for a haircut. Sorry if you could hear people walking past then. It's quite late at night that I'm filming this, which is probably why I'm so like foggy and all over the place, so sorry about that, but they're being very loud down there. Um, moving on, clothes is not getting anything. Joey and Phoebes, this gets stuffed out of their main, uh, my main income. Flat. So this is now a rollover envelope, although I might change it back to not being a rollover envelope and just building it up, I'm not too sure. Um, but £5 has been rolled over, so I'm going to pop that to one side, and it is getting another £10. Ooh. Petrol isn't getting anything. Date night has been spent um, and is getting another £20 this for the next two weeks. Miscellaneous didn't spend that, so that £10 is going to come out for rollover as well. And another £10 to go in. And then food shop is a little bit of a mess. <laughs> so we've got five, 10, 15 pounds left for rollover. So I'm just gonna pop that to one side. And then we've got a bunch of change uh, to deal with. Okay, so for pound coins, we've got one, two, three, four. So they're going to go up there as well. We've got 50, 60, 70. That's a really shiny 20p. Oh my gosh. Uh, 90. Oh my god, so is that one. What year are these minted? Hold on. 2020. Sorry if I'm blinding you. I'm blinding myself if it makes you feel better. Um, they're both 2020. They're so shiny. Wow. Um, 110, <laughs> 120, 130. These coppers, I'm just going to shove to one side. I, of course, still haven't bought the tin um, that I'm going to be putting all my coppers in because I'm a bit useless like that. Um, and then this one, oh, I can't even remember how much it was, 130 is going to go into this envelope for a little bit of extra spending. And then for the next 
two weeks. Actually, yeah, because my um, food shopping doesn't get stuff out of my main income anyway. So it is for the next two weeks. It's going to be getting £50. So 20 40 45 50 Might as well start using some of those fives. There we go, that's everything for the daily spending binder. It feels a lot lighter now that those pound coins have shifted. Oh, I can never bloody close it. Too many envelopes in here, but it is what it is. Um, so yep, this is ready to go back in my bag. And now moving on to the sinking funds binder. Feel like I've had a really really productive week I don't quite know what it is but um, I've been really good at keeping myself motivated and I think it's because I read somewhere or somebody it was a girl on TikTok actually um, said like if you ever wake up and you don't quite feel yourself or you just having a down day if you're really unmotivated start thinking of yourself like as you're controlling your sim and you know if you're just feeling a bit crap about yourself and you don't feel like doing anything with your hair or doing anything like putting any nice clothes on just think like oh but I know this person likes to wear their hair that way so maybe they'll like this or like I don't know I know it sounds weird but um I always have such a problem putting other people before me so thinking of myself as like a different person or like thinking of future me being like she'll really appreciate if I do this now really is helping keeping me motivated um so yeah there was a lot that I wanted to do where I just wanted to go to bed because I've been so shattered since I got home and I was like no do you know what because future me she'll she'll really appreciate that I'm doing this for her um and it here I am being productive still at pff, half eleven <laughs> Um, anyway, I need to stop rambling. Joey and Phoebes, that just gets stuffed out of their rollover. Gift is my main income. Clothes isn't getting anything. Neither is shopping. Events is getting stuffed. And it is getting £10. So five, ten. So events now has 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. Wow. Finally, I can stop spending it and actually build it up a little bit more. So I'm going to colour in one more champagne flute. And then that will be the first row complete. Finally. This saves a total of £250. So we're a fifth of the way there. I don't think I'll be able to save 250 before I go to Oktoberfest. Although actually saying that... Um, I'm going somewhere next weekend and potentially the weekend after, so oh, we'll see. We'll see. Rainy day, unfortunately, is not getting anything. Dentist is actually getting £10. I hate stuffing dentists, it's so boring. <laughs> um, £10. So it now has 10, 20, 30, 35. So I'm just going to colour in one more tooth because each tooth is £10. Um, so even though this tracker reflects 30 now out of the 200 that it saves, because um, it's a five, I'm just not going to bother colouring in the other one until I put the other five in. Anyway, Christmas gets stuffed out of my main income. Holidays, unfortunately, isn't getting stuffed, but I might be booking a last minute um, kind of holiday. I mean, I don't really consider it a holiday. My dad lives abroad, um, so I'd just be going to my dad's house, but I may be going to visit him even as soon as like three weeks time. So I'm not really sure what's happening there, but um, unfortunately, it's not getting stuffed because I did that budget before I knew that petrol again it's not getting anything the additional five that's unaccounted for i'm just going to go ahead and stick into car because that is also on a five and i'd rather put it in car than dentist so car now has and this is for my annual car insurance that 
that's due at the start of every May. Um, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 140 pounds. And I'm just gonna color in, there's my uh, air freshener again. <laughs> um, one more wheel so we actually don't just carry on for the rest of my life on half a wheel. And then savings is getting... I feel like I've gone wrong somewhere. I have. <laughs> Um, I just need to make some change, I think. Yes, I do. Hold on. Bear with me one second. I'm just going to go into Christmas. I see a few tens in there. Oops. I'm going to take two tens out and put a 20 in. Right, sorry about the brief intermission there. Oh my god, my stomach's rumbling. There we go. Right, back to it. Savings is getting £50, which is why I was confused as to why there were 60 left. So 20, 40, 50. So, normally savings would get stuffed out of the um, three stuffings over the month. So, this will be the second. Uh, however, it's obviously going to be going to four now if I'm stuffing my main income twice. Um, so, we're technically halfway through. I try and save £200 um, over the four stuffings in the month. So, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, which is perfect because I am dead halfway. Same with the rollover, um, instead of after three cash stuffings, it's now going to be after four cash stuffings. I hope it makes sense. Um, if I'm not, please just leave a comment and I'll try my best to explain it again. Um, and then last but not least, we have £10 left, a really crusty, musty £10. Um, and that is actually going into furniture. My cat's just decided it's dinner time. Everything goes off when I try to film, I swear. People shouting outside, my air conditioner, not my air conditioner, my air freshener wants some attention. <laughs> um, so, furniture now has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 25, 30, 130 pounds. Let me just find the orange pen. go just made a mess <laughs> and I'm gonna color in one more little couch each couch is worth 10 pounds to save a total of 500 pounds and this will be the first 500 pounds for the furniture for my dream home or my whatever the first time I actually buy is, is that right 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 91 120 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30. Right, well, I don't know what's happened there. I'm going to go and count through all of my envelopes before, I'm, before I colour in that 10. Um, I'm going to go through all of the ones with trackers and just make sure they're the right amount because when sometimes when I'm bill swapping maybe I've made a mistake so there's either 120 or 130 in there I'm not 100% sure <laughs> um, and then all we just need to do now is deal with the rollover so we've got a lot of fives um, so we've managed to roll over so far 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 so let me just Stick that in here with the rest. So many fives. Um, so, so far, I've managed to roll over 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, and 60. 60 pounds. 
which is not too shabby. And then moving right to the front, we've got these pounds to deal with. So we've got two, Phoebe might say hello. We've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pounds. Okay, I've literally just realised as well, this is going to be so good. So I've got nine pounds, so four is the next one to tick off, plus two is six, plus three is nine. So it's going to be all in order again, and that is so perfect. I'm really happy about that. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the four, the two, which makes six, and the three, which makes nine. We're so close to finishing this one now, and this saves £120, which means we've almost saved £120 just in £1 coins this year, which is crazy. So, it's time to crack out. Ooh. RIP. I will be going again, 100%, which is why this is out. Um, hopefully, updates to follow soon. Anyway, um, time to crack out the Time for Change pot. And we're just going to put the nine pound coins in here. And two, three, four, five, six, seven, ooh, eight, and nine. Lovely. So thank you for bearing with me, I know it was quite a long one and it was a rambly one and I've lost my marbles a little bit, I'm not going to lie. But thank you for sticking around, um, the next video you'll see will be my first cash shopping for my main income in August. So yeah, thank you so so much for watching and I'll see you in that video, bye!